We're still off of elbow key, but the wind started picking up like crazy and switched direction a little more from the west. So we moved around to the south side of the island. So we're a little bit protected. And it's been kind of a nasty day, just windy and rainy. It poured last night, poured. We're really here, we gotta go grocery shopping. We're like out of food. That's the whole reason we came to Hope Town. But it was closed. We got here on Sunday and it was closed. And today it poured and we're kind of far. So we might wait till this afternoon or tomorrow. But the good news is it's super windy. We're right over by this place called Tahiti Beach in front of us. And it looks like a cool spot to go kite. So I'm going to go for a kite, I think. Many ways we save water on the boat is by washing everything with salt water and rinsing with fresh water, including ourselves. Billy is demonstrating how to shower off of a boat. Ah. It's Sierra's turn for the thumbnail. We had a rough night last night. It got super windy and we had a charter cat in front of us and some big rocks behind us. So we didn't sleep very much. Yeah, it was it was really, really, really windy. We didn't drag. We had two anchors out and the guy in front of us didn't drag either. So everything went smooth, but we didn't sleep much. We were constantly up looking around, making sure we weren't dragging. So we're gonna go get some groceries. We're finally gonna do what we came here to do in Hope Town and get some groceries. We're not sure. I think Marsh Harbor would be a better place to provision. So we're going to check out Hope Town and if, if the prices for groceries are super expensive, we'll kind of just get what we need for a few days and then we will probably head over to Marsh Harbor in a few days and really load up. And we're going to try to get some bait so we can go fishing. I uh, supposed to get lighter throughout the day, light tomorrow, and then I think light for the next few days. We might have some nice waves tomorrow. So maybe we'll surf that would be awesome. Super excited. All right, here we go. Grocery shopping. 
in Hopetown. I don't know if they're gonna let you in. The grocery store jetty. You're excited, aren't you? You missed your chance, jetty. Perfect timing. I didn't get any, they didn't have any bait. Oh, they didn't? Is there a place that might? Lighthouse Marina or something. And the only meat I got was bacon and like lunch meat because chicken breast was like 25 bucks. We got some ice and bait. Ready to go fishing. Alright, we got all our gear on the dinghy, we're loaded up. You ready? Wish us luck! Going fishing. Gonna catch some dinner. Ready, go. Come. Ooh. All right, we're just anchored up in this little cut. There's a bunch of rocks around and I think some reef and stuff. Water's flowing, incoming tide. We got some squid, we got some shrimp. Gonna catch some fish. I got the first fish. I got a hook in my thumb from trying to take the camera out. What is it? Stay, stay. Yellowtail. All right. Get a nice one. Kind of, right? Yeah. It's a keeper. Definitely. Good job. Porgy or grunt or something. Show the camera. Jenny wants a piece of it. What is that thing? Hey! Jenny's trying. Jenny says I do. Did he poo on you? There he goes, Jenny. Cooper. Too small to keep. You gotta pull him up. Cool. Another good one. What is it? Come on, yellowtail. Grunt. We weren't having too much success in that cut and we tried a few different spots in there so we just came right out into the ocean. A little bit of swell out here, moderate offshore winds, not too bad. A little more quality fish it seems like in here. What do you think, Sierra? I'd say so. We got a yellowtail and Sierra had a little tiny grouper on so maybe, I don't know, hopefully some more yellowtail or something. Whoa! What is it? I have no idea. All I know is it's way too big for this little girl. Uh, it was the same thing that got mine. And the shark took him. Took Sierra's too. Broke the line. Dang, I'm gonna put this thing down for a grouper. And that's a wrap. We got a couple fish. We're gonna eat tonight. Okay, we're back. We caught some dinner. Billy is filleting it. He's probably got the most meat out of anyone. We saved some bait to see if we can use their filleted heads and tails to catch somebody else. Scoot. We have our little fillet table going out back, and we have a shark that came to visit. You can see him. Oh. Dinner is yeah. served. We decided that tonight wouldn't be the best night to shower in the water. We'll be showering in our normal shower.
thank you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for coming along on the adventure with us. This is the first time in our lives where we can actually do this full time because of you guys. And we might still lifeguard this year. We're not sure yet. That's only two months out of the whole entire year. But because of you guys, we can travel and make videos for you. And we're super excited about that. So thank you guys. If you guys want to support and you don't know how, the easiest things to do are just like the videos, comment below, and make sure you're subscribed. You can also share these videos with your friends on your social media. That helps us out a lot. Something else that doesn't cost any money and really helps support us is just to do your Amazon shopping through our Amazon affiliate link. So there's a link in the description below. And if you just click on that link to get to Amazon and then do your normal Amazon shopping, we get a little tiny commission from that and it adds up to really help us keep doing what we're doing. It's no extra cost to you. It's really simple. Just click the Amazon link. You can even bookmark it. So click the link, click bookmark, save it as your bookmark up here on your toolbar. That way every time you go to Amazon you just click that bookmark, you're on Amazon, you can do your Amazon shopping there and that helps us out. Again, no extra cost to you guys. If you want to support further, you can become a patron. Just click the patron link below and you can pledge a dollar a video, five dollars a video, whatever you think the value is to you for our videos. And then you could also cap it out per month if, uh, if you want to set a limit. And the Tula shop is open. So if you like the Tula apparel that you've been seeing around, especially in the pictures at the end of these videos, that all comes from the Tula shop and that's going to be the first link in the video description. But most importantly, make sure you guys comment below with what you like to see in our videos, what you don't like to see. We've been trying to do a good mix of kind of our travels, our day-to-day -day story, or the highlights of our day-to-day -day story and some we throw some history in there because there's some really cool history about the places that we visit so we put a little smidge of history in there and even some educational stuff so like stuff like how to open a bridge uh, with a VHF radio some kind of intro to boating or intro to cruising stuff when we see it appropriate I'd like to talk about some more products that we use all the time not just products that are sponsors but products that we use day to day that you might not know about or maybe we could teach you about them a little bit so I'd like to do a little bit more about that but let us know what you guys want to see what you like what you don't like what you want to see more of thank you guys so much for watching and we will see you next time